been a long day. Got up early this morning, went from really cold weather to hot weather, went from snow to trees with leaves on them. So we're in Orlando, Orlando, Florida. practice facility that's what I'm gonna go see first I'm gonna meet with a couple head men over there with the, with the uh, Orlando Magic I'm gonna give me a tour of the facility we're gonna talk talk about um, you know, the best way to go forward with with us uh, enhancing the basketball movement and what we want to do with the basketball movements facility uh, really excited the reason why I'm doing this is because before I was a player, I mean, and, and, and you know, the basketball movement is already the best facility in the area, in Springfield, Missouri, I mean. But before, you know, I, I took my vision and I took my experience uh, of playing and been in all these facilities. Now that I've been away from playing uh, professionally for four years or so, it's time for me to go back to these places, these facilities that I'm used to being in, um, so I can stay ahead of the game. I'm on my way now to the uh, Orlando Magic uh, practice facility right now. I'm about to meet with a couple guys that's uh, with the Orlando Magic NBA team. Um, we're about to go over the facility. We're about to go over the different things that's involved with the facility. Uh, we're gonna have a, a lot of discussion. I'm really excited about this because uh, it's gonna give uh, the basketball movement and what we're doing an opportunity to grow um, and growth is what I'm all about every day I think we're we're all about growth I am our team of guys are we're all about growth so uh, that's where we're headed right now and um, I'm pumped up so how you doing man yeah, I'm doing all right man thanks for thanks for hustling the bus yeah, yeah, yeah. no problem yeah what's up so I came out here. I was a I was a video guy out there for uh, for a couple of years. It's pretty nice. Coach's locker room. The practice locker room, huh? Yeah. It's pretty nice. It takes me back to my to my college days. Yeah, right. You know, and uh, Jabari sometimes. Yeah. I'm with Jabari sometimes. Yeah. This is where they get all of the taping done. Yeah. Taping all this fun stuff. What's, what, what's this? Oh, is this what, like a conference deal? Or conference, yeah, conference dating. This is pretty neat. What's this? this the so, body fat stuff. Body fat. Conditioning. Figure it out. Yeah. yeah. This you know, keeps them on track. I think they're, they're uh, required. I want to say it's like four, four or five days, like extra mm -hmm. for. Uh, each month to lift, so mm -hmm. it's pretty cool. Just ordered about 10 of these Versa climbers for our facility. I think it's gonna be good for the athletes to uh, uh, yes. get the yeah. total full body, have, total body. Yeah. Body. The practice gym, everything, like, there's no comparison. Right. So. Right, you know, uh, I was talking to, talking to Jason Kidd, mm -hmm. and I'm going down there to Milwaukee because they just built that, that new one there. Mm -hmm. and, and I'm from Milwaukee, yeah. so, you know, I like it. but. I think facilities are important. I think facilities make a yeah. player feel good, right? Yeah. I mean, I mean, in your in your opinion, do you think you know having some of the top notch things in your facility really persuades 100%. some players? Yeah. I mean, I mean, like, like think think about it. Like Denver had a hard time trying to get guys to, to come in in the summer to be like, hey, like let's let's work out. Yeah, let's work out. Let's right. come let's come in here. And right. like they had a hard time trying to get guys to go. And now, now they'll be okay, but like, it's because their former strength coach, Steve Hess, who was there for forever. He's a good guy, right? He's the best. Oh, I love him. So. He, he just left this past year from, right? He just yeah, left. so. But now he's got his own gym. So like, guys will come back for like, guys will, guys will come to Denver. 
I guarantee you this is gonna happen this summer. They will they will play pickup in that gym, and they'll they'll like they'll probably just do everything at Hess's gym this summer. I'm sitting here in the Orlando Magic practice facility. It's it's unbelievable. Uh, it really gives me more to look forward to, more to build. Basketball movement is looking forward to its transition of continuing to get better. Yep. Remind me of myself. Just uh, shoes everywhere. Don't care. Don't care. Don't care. I remember, man, when I was uh, when I was in Milwaukee, the Bucks in 2003. Coach Carl was the coach. Okay. Dude, they had a new pair of shoes, a new toothbrush. Yeah. A, a new everything every day, and I'm yeah. just like, who the? I, yeah. I told people, hey man, stop putting new stuff in my. Stop, yeah. Stop doing that. It's like we're good. I'm yeah. good, man. Don't don't bring me a new toothbrush. Yeah. Man. It's not like that, but this is. Yeah, it's, it's too much. So I got a full effort machine here. Yeah, so, wow. Anytime, yeah, guy gets hurt, comes right in here. Boom. E immediate, immediate, immediate attention. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Go on the go on the treadmill, put the iPad on, watch a game, wow. scout a game, and then you're good. It's, so both yeah. are hot or one hot, one cold? I, think, I, I couldn't even tell you. I think one's hot, one's cold. Yeah. That's, that's the standard around the league. So, yeah. that is one, that is, I'll say this, the Denver's. They just got a brand new, uh, like the pool, like the workout pools and everything. So like that's cool. Yeah, so little barber chair. Um, pretty much every team now, they all know, mm -hmm. make it easy. They all bring their own guys in. So it's great. <laughs> bring a little entourage with. Them. Yeah. So uh, so this is where these guys come here. You know, basically breakfast, lunch, dinner. They'll come here in the morning, um, have a meal. We have full time. We have a full time uh, chef here, so they'll come here, have a meal, go work out, you know, do whatever. Uh, after practice, they always have a nice full spread here. Uh, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner. When it's a practice day, right. but they'll have they'll have three meals for them uh, for uh, for game days and everything. So, whenever whenever these guys need to eat, it's, it's well stocked for them. Yeah. This is, this is dope, though. Yeah. I tell you, I, I really appreciate you showing us around. Man. No, no worries. Great, we're gonna, we're gonna have to hook up. Yeah. No, for sure. Hook up, you know, for sure. You in. Yeah. No. Just came out of the meeting. It's a successful meeting. Uh, I'm really pumped up. I'm going to LA. <laughs> going down there to LA um, this this next weekend. Uh, we're gonna check out their facilities. Uh, pumped up, pumped up. It was fun. Uh, really nice. Uh, I want to say thank you to the Orlando Magic, the NBA. Orlando Magic, I uh, want to say thank you. Had a great time. Uh, hopefully our facility will uh, compete with yours.